My name is Larry Geller. I'm testifying today as an individual. Um, you have my written testimony that I uh, submitted via the website, but um, I'd like to start with something else. I, uh, when, I, when I heard the uh, managing director say that Hawaii is in the vanguard of Housing First, I bristled. This is 2014, folks. Housing First has been around since maybe 2004, 2005, or even earlier. So thank you for your free Wi-Fi. I Googled it. And I think this is really important. I, I, I want you to know that uh, this isn't frivolous. Housing First or similar programs are the key to something I think everybody in this room wants, which is a reduction in homelessness for the benefit of everybody, the people involved, the tourist industry, everyone in, uh, in this case in Honolulu. We all want that. Okay. Uh, housing First, the first hit, Denver, 2006, the study, this is a cost study that found that uh, emergency room visits and costs were reduced an average of 34.3%. Hospital inpatient um, costs reduced 66%. Detox visits were reduced 82%. Um, and finally, uh, incarceration, incarceration days and costs were reduced by 76%. 77% of those entering the program continued to be housed in the program after two years. Folks, this is evidence this stuff works. The next hit was Utah that was mentioned, and it, it just Google goes on and on. Um, that's what works. Now, bless the IHS folks for what they do. Um, I'm, a, I'm a big fan, but that's not the solution for Honolulu, nor are the uh, bills before you. You've heard adequate testimony, I think, that they work the other way. Now, I, as a taxpayer, um, object to you taking stuff out of my, money out of my wallet at night while I'm asleep for things that don't work. I think everybody should be concerned. These bills will increase our costs. You're gonna not just face lawsuits. They basically, you're foregoing the benefits that you would have if we had a Housing First program. By the Housing First, I don't mean putting 50 or 100 people into Housing First. That's what you heard here. That's what you've read. We need a Housing First program that provides an adequate program to make the difference, to produce the numbers, to produce the results we want. We don't have that yet. It's maybe to come, but we don't have it. Okay, so what's the rush on passing these bills? Um, to get in, just quickly dive into my testimony. I'm not gonna go through the whole thing. Um, there's no rush, folks. We've, we've seen pressure in the newspaper, complaints on the front page about what's going on on the streets. Uh, the editor selects letters to the editor that are complaining. Okay, well, check out today's paper. You have to dig for it. What they don't tell you is that Hawaii sets records. Uh, July set a uh, all-time record for both visitor spending and arrivals. So where's the evidence that this is hurting tourism? I personally believe it will one day affect tourism if nothing's done. But you're going to do something about it, aren't you? So instead of rushing headlong into this because of pressure from the tourist industry, oh, and I thank them for the one bathroom. I, th I think one bathroom. Come on, folks. Let's get real with what it's going to take. This is nothing easy. It's going to take a real commitment from each of you as, as our leaders and as our legislators. And several of you, by the way, have experience over at the state legislature, I remember. So maybe you could walk across the street and light a fire under them because... Many of the services that are necessary to make Housing First work and to reduce homelessness in Hawaii are a state responsibility. In fact, the number of people on the street with mental illness uh, today, and I don't know how to classify that number, but a large portion of that I hold are as a result of state cuts in mental health services that occurred between 2007 and the present time that dumped people out of supportive services the, uh, the wraparound services that were keeping them in their home and that would be necessary to make Housing First work when implemented in, in uh, Honolulu. The Department of Health cut those services. They also cut intensive uh, case management from as much as uh, 30 hours a month if necessary down to three and a half hours. And while there are no statistics, those people were dumped out into the street. In order to move people from the street back into either Housing First or affordable housing, the state needs to make a complete about-face and 
restore the mental health services that support people and keep them in housing. Um, so there's no rush. What you're doing, I mean, just an end summary here. Um, we need to get every bit of this in place. We need those mental health services, which you can't provide. The state needs to. It won't work unless they're provided. Uh, we need not to have you pass these bills. We need you to wait until there's housing first. And we need you not to wait for housing first. We need you to push them and get real housing first. You Thank won't you. need these bills. And we don't need the lawsuits. And I don't need you taking any money out of my pocket for um, <laughs> lawsuits. And by the way, I, I have on uh, my Disappeared News blog photos that passerbyers gave me of garbage trucks attending these raids. Mm -hmm. And Doug has videos posted of garbage trucks at the raids. <laughs> the IDs, the medicine, the personal belongings have gone into those garbage trucks and are not retrievable. I have spoken to people. One woman had her colostomy bag thrown into the garbage truck, and that made the newspaper. And this is the solution to homelessness. So please... Get behind Housing First. Help it happen. We, 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 I, I know there's, you know, there, there's summits, there are committees, there are working groups. Whatever it takes, let's get to Housing First with a real budget, with real people assigned to tasks to put people in housing, to find those houses wherever it is. Real people, real budget, real timelines. When you've got a timeline in front Thank of you, you very much. then you can look at these bills. Thank you. Members, any questions?